Hey learners, today we will cover up a widely studied topic called concept and types of unemployment. Unemployment, the first thing that comes to our mind when we hear this is jobless. It means need a job. Therefore, we must say that unemployment depicts workers who do not have jobs but are looking for jobs. According to Jose Ortega Y. Gasset, an unemployed existence is a worse negation of life than death itself. It's definitely true. If a person is in a situation where he needs a job but he does not have a job, he is unemployed and he cannot eat because of unemployment or his family cannot eat, then he is forced to commit suicide. Now, let's see what is unemployment. It occurs when a person who is actively searching for employment is unable to find work. The most frequent measure of unemployment is unemployment rate, which is number of unemployed people divided by number of labor force. Unemployment not only forces people to commit suicide, it also affects the people mentally and physically. We can see in this picture stress, depression, etc. are results for mentally effects of unemployment. Similarly, physical effects, sleeping disorders, eating disorders, etc. Now, look at the graph. Line diagram that depicts unemployment rate from January 2016 to November 2019. Where we see that the unemployment rate in January 2016 was 872 there we see that in July 2017, the unemployment rate decreased a lot. But this rate started raising again and in November 2019, it increased to 7.48. Let's take a look the two types of unemployment. One, rural unemployment and another, urban unemployment. We are discussing rural unemployment today. India is an underdeveloped through a developing economy. The nature of unemployment therefore sharply differs from the one that prevails in industrially advanced countries. Lord Keynes attributes the cause of unemployment to a deficiency of effective demand, but in India, Unemployment is mainly due to the shortage of capital, the poor exploitation of natural resources and inadequate employment opportunities. That a large number of the ruralites are forced to remain jobless in the rural areas is a true beyond dispute. There are two types of the rural unemployment. One, seasonal unemployment. And another, and it's a very famous, disguised unemployment. So, the seasonal unemployment means the demand for a specific kind of work and workers change with a change in season, especially in rural areas. Such as agriculture industry, wherein the demand for the workers is more during harvesting that is required in another month in a year. The second type of the rural unemployment is obviously the famous disguised unemployment. Disguised unemployment is a kind of unemployment in which there are people who are visibly employed but are actually unemployed. 
In a country like India having a high population pressure, more people are engaged in the agricultural sector than the required number. Even if some workers are withdrawn from the agricultural sector, total agricultural output remains the same. Those persons who can be withdrawn without affecting total agricultural output are called disguisedly unemployed persons. As we see in this picture, an agricultural field requires just a three labors, but the people engaged in this activity is a six. Then this unemployment for the three labors is called disguised unemployment. So, today we are concluding here, and in our next video, we will discuss urban unemployment briefly. Please like and subscribe my channel for more content. Press the bell icon for further information. Thank you.